Hi, everybody. Bob Pickett. Look who's in the studio with us right now, Gretchen Wilson. Hi, welcome. Thank you. Well, I got to tell you, I've been a fan since Redneck Woman came out, and you've got some pretty big plans for this year. A brand new album's coming out. Mm -hmm. On March 30th. Now, uh, the title. Yeah, I Got Your Country Right. Here. Now, how did you get the title for uh, that? It was just a, a great song that I heard um, and uh, that you know I wanted to include on the record, and it really... That particular song and that, um, that the title track, it pretty much just sets up the vibe for the rest of the whole record. It, it just kind of lets you know. And, and at one point I had somebody tell me, oh, that's way too long of a title for a record. They wanted me to drop the right here part, but that's the attitude that's part the of attitude. it. That's the attitude. I got your country right here. <laughs> and that's pretty, it just sets up the rest of the record. Well, let's, let's talk about your debut single, Redneck Woman. That set up the career right there because that's not just a song. That's an anthem, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, it is. I mean, I think um, I think women were just really ready for something that was just, you know, that sounded like their life, you know, uh -huh. that it wasn't, you know, I mean, I don't know too many women whose life consists of all butterflies and rainbows and just happy, happy, happy all the time. Most of us are, are living a real life and we have our own sets of uh, issues and troubles and um, I think it was just time. I think uh, American women wanted to hear something that just sounded real to him. It sounded more like their life. Is that your life, Redneck Woman? Yes, it is. Still? Still, still <laughs> it is. I still take the, the, the four-wheeler to the bus, you know. I've got my clothes hanging sometimes in a John Deere Gator and just That's travel the way to over do it. the bus. And, yeah. Now, so I t this is a rumor I picked up on the Internet. Are, are you really doing a reality TV show? Um, I've been, yeah, I have kind of not, I'm not sure yet. I'm okay. not sure if it's going to end up happening yet, but we have, uh, we have filmed some things and we have talked to some people and we, there are, there are, it's a possibility that it could happen in the future, but it's not set in stone yet. So it's Is not it just people thing. following you around day to day life? No, it was, it was actually, uh, like my home and family and on the farm and, and stuff like that. It's, it's pretty comical and uh, I just don't know if it's, uh, if it's exactly, I don't know that I have time for it. I don't know if it's going to be able to pan out into my schedule and all of that stuff so it's, it's one of those things that's just up in the air but it was uh it was more like a you know if, uh, if the beverly hillbillies met the osbournes kind of a thing <laughs> that's a cool concept i mean i used to love to watch tanya tucker's reality TV yeah, show tuckerville yeah. which was great yeah i saw i saw one episode of it and she's she's hysterical well i she's hope this really hope fun. this comes true for you hope it works out yeah i mean it, it would be it would be a fun thing to do it would be a fun project to do but it, it, it does take a lot of time i mean they don't uh -huh. just it, you know you think you think about reality television and you'd like to think that they're actually just following you around and it's all happening in real time but it's you, you learn right away when you're filming on TV and nothing is actually in real time. It's, it all has to be shot 15 times from 15 different angles, and pretty soon it starts to not really feel like reality anymore at all. Even reality TV, Even they reality do TV, that. yeah, they do. Yeah, that was kind of a bummer for yeah, me. Yeah, I think you just, wow. Out. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll never watch Survivor the same way. No, I can tell you that. no, it's it's <laughs> yeah, and see, I I thought the same way you did. I thought it was going to be one thing, and then as we got into it, it wasn't at all what I thought it was going to be. So that's another kind of thing that's going on there. I'm not sure how it's going to work out. Wow. Now let's talk about also about your record label. Okay. Now, uh, are, you, are you the only artist on, on Redneck Records? I have started to work with another artist, but um, we haven't gotten far enough into the into the project yet. For but me you're to the president, though, right? I'm the president and CEO, and I'm answering the phones, and I'm making See? all the... Yeah, it's a, it's a lot of work, but it's uh, it's really rewarding, and it's it's uh, it's a perfect time in my career for me to be able to really just grab hold of, of the reins and, and, and take control of everything. And uh, it feels really good to know that... Uh, well, that you know, just to know what what's going on all the time. Uh -huh. You know, being involved with a major label was was awesome. You know, and I did learn a lot of things. But there's so many people involved in every decision that you make, and, and sometimes I felt like I had to have three meetings just to see if I could have the meeting. Wow. You know, and it was like oh, it moved really slow. And I'm 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 more of a you know I like to just go with my gut and make a decision and then and then start moving on it. So it's it, for me, you know, the last few months it seems like things have just moved so much faster, and it really feels good to me. Well, we're looking for the brand new CD, and of course, to, to hear you on the radio as well. Now, your website for all the details on Gretchen Wilson. The website address is GretchenWilson.com, or you can go to or you can go to Redneck Records. So, so Gretchen Wilson, and I hope the the reality TV thing does come out because she would be great to watch on TV, right? It was, it's pretty funny stuff. They just got to let us be a little more real, and then maybe we'll be able to get somewhere. <laughs> got it. Thank you.